after <coughs> we have remarks by uh, Sirin Mustafa Gainde Fatma for 15 minutes. Sirin Bake, you will come. Alhamdulillahi min ash-shaytani rajim. Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim. Alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin. Ar-Rahman r-Rahim. Maliki yawm al-Din. Iyaka na'budu wa iyaka nasta'in. Ahdina as-sirat al-mustaqim. Sirat al-lazina amta alihim. Ghayri al-ma'dubi alihim wa al-tarlin. Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim. Wa al-asr. Inna al-insana lafi qusr. إلا الذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات وتواسوا بالحق وتواسوا بالصبر بكي جلتي بكي فتاو السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته جنا جلتوتي في أي كادو يو أنجلي فاتلي سما بوك فاتلي بسبي Jago inga hamne bingkung di kedai fakir lagi 1988 dok nengko akal lenat cilim jur sog bar kelu cibisbi waktu jam mencinga hamne mau sabab lip mui borong tua Dear brothers and sisters, excellencies, congressmen and senators, we are today celebrating the 20th anniversary of Sheikh Ahmad Bamba Day in Harlem. I would like to seize this opportunity to express my deepest gratitude to all those who have for the past 20 years made efforts in an attempt to have successful Shah Ahmad Bamba days in the United States and particularly in Harlem. We would like to remind people that this day of July 28th was first proclaimed by David Patterson who at the time was a city council member. That same David Patterson today is a governor of the state of New York. Never in the history of the United States we have seen a blind, legally blind black man uh, be the head as governor of, the, of any state. Uh, it is something that we have to ponder upon. And we also would like to remind people that David Dinkins, who at the time, back in 1988, was also the Manhattan Borough President, proclaimed July 28th as Shah Ahmad Bamba Day in Harlem. David Dinkins later became the mayor, the first black African-American mayor of New York City. We would like to also 
at the time uh, thank someone who's present here and who we tend to forget, who has made the very first event in the United States possible, and that is Mr. Mumar Fal. He is here. He was the first gentleman who was able, with a colleague of his from Egypt, to have the library given to us. That's when Shah Mahmoud Murtada, radiallahu anhu, first set foot on these premises. Also, would like to express our our gratitude to Harvey Balazi, who's not here today, but who was instrumental in making the first Bismillah uh, uh, volume, please volume. Bismillah. Bismillah. Oh, Bismillah. 